Good morning everyone. Right now it is about 7.30 a.m. and I am exhausted because I had to wake up at 4 a.m. this morning and every other morning of the weekday because I have to drop off my mom off work. She doesn't drive. So I have to take that responsibility of driving her to work every morning at 4. So, um, usually I would be asleep right now before I have to drop off my little sister to school, but for some reason I couldn't go back to sleep and this is really unhealthy for me. And I have a huge migraine and like, I have a tummy ache as well. And I'm pretty nauseous. So, I'm not feeling well, but I have to pop these videos out because I am, I am late. I am off track. I am late on schedule. So today I'm going to tell you guys the third car accident I've been in, hopefully the last. Hopefully I'm not in any other, you know, car accidents anymore. Future car accidents, you know. But this was a very major car accident. Um, the first two car accidents I told you, told you that the car has survived and it was the same car in both accidents actually. Um, that car lasted our family about I want to say 17 to 18 years. So it was a pretty old car and. When I had the accidents, when the accidents occurred, it was like, well, my stories, at least, because I know my parents told me they had that car, and they had, like, prior accidents, but within my accidents, when I was driving, and my driving career with that car, I had, that car was, like, 18 years old, so it was a pretty old car, um... But yeah, those first two accidents that I've experienced with the car, the accident wasn't major at all. Like the first story I told you, there was no damage. The second story I told you, there was a dent, but you couldn't really tell. And my parents didn't know about it until the third car accident when it was told. Oh yeah, until after we got a new car, I told them that I was in the second car accident. They didn't really notice anything but I if you felt it you could notice that there was definitely a dent there there was a dent there and if you move your head in a certain way or the angle you could see the dent if the sun hit it right but it wasn't a big damage but this third car accident was severe the whole left side of my car of that car was demolished and this is what had happened um, I was I just picked up my mother from work and we were on our way home after picking up Chinese food for dinner. And um, I was heading home. And the arrow, the arrow turned yellow. The arrow turned left. <laughs> turned yellow. And my mom said stop. But the light just literally turned yellow. So I knew I had time and I was close. But my mom, she's very paranoid, so she said, no, stop. So I slammed on the brakes, unknowing that, not knowing that there was a pickup truck behind me that was following me. And when I slammed on the brakes, I was going about 45, 50 miles an hour, trying to catch the yellow light. And so was the um, pickup truck behind me. We were unaware that I was there, and <clears throat> I was not. But I'm experienced now. I wasn't an experienced driver back then. Um, this was about three years ago. So yeah. Um, as you can watch, I slammed on the brakes and the pickup truck behind me slammed into my um, car. And the whole, and I think he saw that I did a sudden stop. Like my, my brake lights in the back just like randomly turned on. And he, he was about to um, um, switch lanes, trying to avoid to hit me, but it was a little too late. So he was going to try to turn um, right to the right lane because I told you it was I was headed left because the yellow light had left. So he, I guess he saw my right, my um, brake lights gone, but it was, and he was trying to turn right to the right lane to avoid hitting me, but it was too late. So um, he hit Oh, not the whole left side of my car was demolished. The whole right side of my car was demolished. And the passenger seat on my right side. So my mom got most of the impact when he smashed into our car. 
and um, my bumper fell off. The my brake lights was broken. Um, and then the light. He after he hit me, he drove up to my passenger window seat, and my mom rolled down the window and he rolled down the window. I was like, why did you guys stop? And my mom started yelling at him. What do you mean? Why we did we stop? It's a red light. And then um, he just drove on because the, um, the light, the there was a green light to go straight. Remember, the red, the arrow was had turned red after, so we were stopped. And but the light right next to us was green for the traffic ahead to go. So my mom, so the driver just like zoomed off. He didn't stop to get information at all. And um, my mom knew that I was a new driver, and I couldn't, I didn't have the fastest reaction to chase him down because he literally just hit, was trying to do a hit and run. And so he drove by, but then he, there was a bus stop uh, like half a block from the accident where the accident occurred. And he stopped in that little bus stop to get out of his car and check the damage in, in his. Um, in his in the front of his truck and my mom walked the crosswalk and went started running on the sidewalk trying to go towards the bus stop where he had parked just to try to get his information and told him hey you can't run off after hitting us so he, but my mom was too slow and he saw my mom running after him and he got back into his truck and drove off um and mind you you guys my mom was so close to calling the police, but thank God she didn't. This is why. Uh, the weekend before this accident had occurred, I we went to the mall and I lost my wallet that had my license in it. And my mom at this time didn't know that I lost my wallet. So if he had stopped and tried to, you know, share his information, get information, and if we had gone through the process and called the police, then I would have been in so much trouble because I had lost my license and I was literally driving without a license for about, I want to say, a good week and a half. So, that was scary. What did you say, Mama? So, after that, I, um, that's something that happened. And, Mom, and then we got a new car. So, that was the third car accident that. <laughs> Happen. Hope you guys like it. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.